All right, what's going on dudes and welcome back to Hexit where we're gonna try to craft a bag to see if we can put backpacks inside of it and bags inside of backpacks, so on and so forth. And yo dog, I heard you like bags and backpacks. So we put a bag inside your backpack, inside your bag, inside your backpack, inside your bag, inside your backpack so we could give you infinite inventory space. Anyway, I think we have the resources we need to craft it. So let's go ahead and do that. Some leather and a piece of string. And I think we have a chest in our chest here. So that is all we need in order to craft the bag, and let's do it. Chest in the middle, leather around the outside, and a piece of string. Boom. Okay, we have a bag. Now, the moment of truth is to see if we can put a backpack inside of it. And if we can, it's going to be glorious. Okay, let's see. Bag. Open it up. Okay, so we have nine, nine slots. And I think we just so happen to have nine ten backpacks so we can put yes 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 it is glorious we have infinite inventory space <laughs> this is amazing i'm so happy right now so we can put all of our inactive backpacks into here and then and then even better we can open up this will work this will work Huzzah! oh my god it's amazing okay <laughs> yo dog we put backpacks inside your bag inside your backpack so that you could save lots of space, you know? Okay, so I think I'm gonna throw the freezer right sword in there as well. And now just to make sure it's working properly. So actually, let's close it up. Okay, it's closed out. And now take it back out. You haven't erased our inventory, have you? No, they still exist. Oh my God, it's amazing. Now, what if I put, what if I put, okay, so hold on. I'm gonna put the big lime green backpack with all of our stuff inside of it and then and then it's gonna have, so there's gonna be stuff inside the backpack, inside the bag, and then we're gonna go inside the backpack and put the bag in, and now it's four layers deep. Oh my god, we must go deeper. Okay, let's see, so now let's just make sure that everything is still there, so then we have the bag, the backpack inside of it, and we open up the backpack. Oh, and it still has our stuff, this is amazing. Okay, we literally have infinite inventory space, this is the best. Okay, so let's throw the backpack back in there, let's open up our backpack and throw the bag in there, and I think we're good. Oh my god, this is magical. And then let's put our long shoe back in there. Okay, we have officially the best inventory strategy of all time. And now I'm just going to fill up so much on stuff that I'm never going to want to arrange my inventory and put it back in chests here. That's going to be the only issue. Anyway, okay, so now that that's been taken care of, something that I want to do is I want to get into Tinker's Construct a little bit because I was looking into it a little bit more and it's super cool. So Tinker's Construct is a mod where basically you can arrange different parts of tools and weapons and stuff and put them together all separately in order to create like super duper magical pickaxes and swords and rapiers and, and things and stuff and apparently like a rapier for example um, it pierces through armor, so if I had had a rapier with the super duper annoying magical dude who we had to use the pain of pigs on, uh, we might have been able to kill him. So I want to try to get into Tinker's Construct, and I'm wondering where I put the introduction book to it. I had to put it somewhere. I didn't get rid of it, did I? No? Alright, well anyway, I sort of outlined what I need to do regardless of the book, so I need to make a, a big smelting station. I was watching a tutorial the other night and um, oh there it is. Materials and you and materials and you. So anyway first things first regardless I need to uh, I need to get a whole bunch of these brick things. What are they called? Um, they're called seared bricks. In order to make seared bricks we need seared bricks um, but smaller seared bricks. In order to get the, the smaller seared bricks we need to smelt grout and grout is made from sand, gravel, and clay. Sand and gravel, not really an issue. However, clay is a little bit more difficult to come by, but in Hexit, there's a recipe here that you can use red cobblestone. The only thing I don't know is, is if the buckets are consumed in that process, but it gives you four pieces of clay in return. And I kind of want to just try this out because, well, I'm going to keep my fingers crossed that the buckets are not consumed in that transaction, but we may as well find out. So let's grab, do we have three buckets? No, we have to make one more. Um, if, hopefully, the buckets are not consumed when you do that crafting recipe, it should be a pretty viable way to actually get some clay, because I think that we get the red cobblestone over at the, uh, the red sand biome over there that you can see in the upper left of my mini-map. So, let's head over there. Let's fly on over. Whee! 
And here we are, just using up a whole bunch of my electric staff, but oh well, it was worth it because now we're already there, and I think this is red cobblestone right on the ground here. So, let's see. Is it? Um, yes, it is. So, okay, let's do some calculations. I'm trying to envision um, how you do the, the smeltery setup in Tinker's Construct. Um, it was... Uh, hey, don't interrupt me. I'm thinking about things. Rude. So it was 3 by 3 by 3, so 12 plus 9, 21. So we need 21 uh, big, big seared bricks. And then we need little smaller like parts and stuff, like a, a basin and a constructor like furnace power thing. So we need we need a few extra pieces. So let's say we need 100 pieces of clay um, in order to, to do it. So why don't we actually, let's just we get a few to start with. Um, because I, I still don't know for sure if um, we're going to be able to do that crafting recipe. So I just need to find some water. Um, let me go over here and see if we can use this water. I see a couple different pools over here. Okay. So, got our bricks. And let's see. I'm turning it into, uh, hopefully this doesn't erase the water. Hold on. All right. So let's fill up these two. And, okay, cool. It's an infinite water supply. And moment of truth. Ooh, come on. Please don't consume the buckets. Please don't consume the... Oh! Oh, they're back in my inventory! Yes! This is totally viable! Oh my god, so all I need to do here, all I need to do is just keep filling up the buckets. And, okay, infinite water supply. If only I could shift-click the buckets into my crafting grid, that would be a fantastic time saver, but unfortunately I can't. Um, and unfortunately they can't stack either. Anyway, okay, so it gives me the buckets back, it gives me the clay, so all I need to do now is I need to mine out like a hundred red bricks and then I can just keep doing that. So what I'll probably do is just go off camera and take care of this because it's not going to be an entirely interesting process to watch. Um, but once we reach the end, then I'll have uh, hopefully enough clay to where we will be able to start making gravel. Well, I will have to go in and find some sand and, and gravel, but those aren't really that hard to to find and you're gonna need to stop. I'm trying to mine stuff, don't you see? Just leave me alone for a little bit here while I go and mine. Alright, so what am I at? Actually, you know what? I can I can easily just mine a hundred really quickly. It's just gonna be the the process of actually no, I don't need a hundred. I need a hundred pieces of clay, which only requires like uh, twenty five, so I'm good there. Um can I do math properly? Nope. Okay, so there we go. So all I need to do is keep doing this, and good, the water keeps filling in. So I just need to do this, um, how many more? 23, 22 more times, and then, well, that'll be it. So let me just go ahead and uh, cut until we've taken care of this whole process. And when we return, it'll be all good, and we'll have lots and lots of clay, and it'll be daytime, or maybe it'll be nighttime again. I don't even know how long it's going to take, hopefully not too long. But I will see you when the process is complete. And last one, and then we will have our 100 pieces of clay. I actually got the process going pretty quickly. All I had to do was click, 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 and boom, and now we'll get a little bit extra, boom, and boom, and shift, and then fill up again, and repeat. So it's pretty quick, actually. Um, anyway, now all we need to do is dig out a bunch of sand, find some gravel as well, and I don't know, is there actually an easy way to make gravel? I'm not sure, so let me see. Uh, let me just get to gravel really quickly. Boom, and gravel. You can make gravel with gravel. Well, that's good to know, um, but no shortcut for it. So we'll just need to find a bunch of gravel, 100 pieces of that or so. 100 pieces of sand will not be difficult to come by at all. Um, so I guess we'll have to, I don't know, we'll have to try to find like a gravel beach or something uh, because that'll be the easiest way, I think, to get a whole bunch of gravel. Um, where was, I know there was a gravel beach somewhere that we've been before. Um, but I can't remember where it was. Hmm. Well, I guess we can focus on sand first. And then, wee, wee. <laughs> okay, so we're back, and... I don't know, should I put the red cobblestone anywhere in case we still need it? I'll just put it in this chest over here. Um, and then I don't think we need all three of our buckets any longer, so I'll put them in here. And I guess what I, what I could do is, um... I could just go out and, and explore, and uh, we'll bring a shovel with me. Let's bring a shovel. Where where can I find a shovel? In here. I know I have a 
diamond shovel with efficiency two, you can actually probably get like 100 pieces of sand in, in a couple of seconds. So let me just, actually let me go somewhere where I don't really care about ruining the beach that's not right next to Jerry's tree. So, I don't know, let's go over here and see if we can find some sand that will uh, will be worth our while. Is there, there's an egg. I thought I, thought I missed something there. Anyway, okay, so hey, no more black smoke. We're saved. No, no, why are you, why are you still here? Oh my God. Well, it's a good thing we came back, isn't it? Um, so we need you. And please don't continue to be obnoxious like this. Seriously, like why, why are you here? Why are you here? Can you go away? Can you go away? Yeah, you can go, oh, thank you. Thank you, it's so kind, so kind for going. Let's check around here anymore. Um, why are you still here? Why? Why you? Why do you exist? Why do you still exist? Why are there so many? I better go back and check the other thing. Um, hold on, along the way I'll just mine out a whole bunch of sand. With efficiency too, it'll probably happen in just a few seconds. Oh man, the rift remover is, it's expired. Thankfully we have a couple more. Uh, okay, so where's a good place? Where is a good sandy beach to get to? Oh, just across? No, that's not a good place. How about, I guess over here might be better. Uh, there seems to be a bunch of sand. I see a big sandy beach that I can completely demolish my efficiency to shovel. I should have actually repaired my freezerite leggings while I was back home. Uh, maybe I'll go back and do that pretty quickly. Hold on, let me just run over to the place that has the stuff. Maybe we'll find something cool along the way. The world may never know. All right, let's keep going, woo! And here we go, nice big sandy beach. Okay, so let's get all of the sand. All right, should go pretty quickly. I guess we'll, we'll aim for another 100, and that'll make us 100 pieces of grout. It'll be great, let me just mine out. I guess one layer all the way across the beach should suffice. How many are we at? We're at 31. And very shortly we will get to, oh, it's a horse. Oh, I have a saddle. I, have, I need to, okay, we, we're gonna knock so many things out, it's gonna be the best. <laughs> Don't go anywhere, don't go anywhere, it's strange Gumby, Gumby need horse. I need you, I must test. I must test if you are saddle accessible or if you're just there for show. Anyway, um, 64, 20, we're almost there. Almost there. And thank you, Efficiency 2, for making this go a lot faster. Okay, I think we're good. Yes, we are most definitely good indeed. Okay, so, hold on. Rift Remover. I don't know, can I repair it? Is that why it's not completely gone, despite the fact that it has zero durability left? Oh, well, we'll keep it. And it's horse riding time. Are you ready? Are you ready, Hi-Ho Silver? Okay, here we go. And, oh! Oh, it doesn't even use the saddle? Oh my god, that's amazing. I can have, so all I need is one saddle forever? And are you tamed now and everything? Oh, you want me to, oh, you want me to go high ho silver on you? Yeah, hold on, hold on. Yes, yes, he's, can you? No, he's not happy. He's just chilling. He's not, nope. Do I need to feed you like an apple maybe? Hold on, hold on. What do I need to, what do I need to do? What, what sort of deal do I need to make with you? to make this process work. Hmm. 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 Do you like do you like the taste of magic essence or holy hand grenades? I've heard that those are a delicacy over back in the Jerry Street region, you know? Don't go any don't go anywhere. Well I guess I didn't waste a saddle, so it's not like the end of the world. But don't go anywhere. I shall return with apples. Please, please just just accept my my token of gratitude with the oh hey, it's another another thing. Another stronghold thing over here. Um, what the heck? Is that a friggin' giraffe? Oh my god. Seriously, are there giraffe? There are giraffes here? What is this? What is can I ride a giraffe? I want to ride a giraffe. Can I ride a giraffe? I can ride a giraffe, right? 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 Yeah, let's ride a giraffe. Can I ride you? No? Hey, well guess what? Guess what? You may be tall, but I can jump over your head. So how does that make you feel? Because you won't let me ride you. Wow, rude. Very rude. Um, well, any hoosers, I guess, uh... I guess we're, oh my god, they're, oh my god, they're so, oh my goodness, this is amazing. There's so many giraffes. It's like, oh, and there are elephants? Whoa, we're in like the savanna plains of Africa. Whoa, dude, this is crazy. Since when did we get like mo creatures installed here? Um, man, oh man, elephant, oh, dude, this is pretty sweet. Can I ride the elephant? 
You, do you accept saddles? As a... Well, I'm, I'm inside you. And uh, Hexa just got very angry with me for being inside the elephant. So it crashed. So... <laughs> nice. Nice. Hexa doesn't like when you go inside the elephant. Keep that in mind. So it turns out Hexa didn't crash. It just stuttered a bit when uh, the elephant was getting really mad at me. <laughs> The elephant did not, did not like my going inside of it. Okay. All right, calm down. Calm down there. Calm down. Oh, what the heck? Yes. See, making the elephants angry has its benefits. All right, awesome. So I got the hexit flower. Um, and there's more dimensional doors over there. And then, oh my god, there's another goblin stronghold thing up in the sky too. Are you kidding me? This place is ridiculous. Okay, anyway, okay. Okay, so I gotta be on the lookout for more hexaflowers, flowers, because then maybe we can actually make the final piece of our armor, which uh, I should put on at the moment because I'm not actually walking over water, perhaps. Or maybe I'll just, you know. Anyway, okay, so another goblin stronghold. Should we should we want to have something to, to fight? And then also, I need to go back. I'm hoping that the horse is not despawned, and I need to get some apples. If not, we'll just find another horse, but I need to... I need to at least try taming a horse and <gasps> another hexaflower. Oh my god, this is the best day ever. Okay, that was that's two. That's two. That's two. That's two. And then do we have two or do we have one bag of Jerry's tree? Because if we have two bag of Jerry's tree, then we have everything. Hold on, hold on, hold on. And we have the we have the leggings. Oh my goodness, things are gonna be real in just a few minutes here if I have two back home. Oh my god. Okay. So let me just make sure. No other hexaflowers. Have I missed any? No. No, no. I mean, there's a blue one over there. That's not a hexaflower, though. It's too big. Um, hmm. Oh man, this is the most fruitful environment for looting stuff ever. Okay, and more Jacoby Bryant's all all over the place. All right. Well, anyway, let me go back to my command block really quickly and just make sure that I only have one or two hexit thingamadoo hickers back home. We have. Where did I put it? Did I put it in here. Where, actually, where, where did I put it? I don't know where I put it. Because um, we definitely had at least... Hold on, was it... No, god dang it. I don't actually know where. Oh, did I put it inside the back? I put it inside the backpack. So we have three total. Um, nice. Well, anyway, I need I needed to get apples, so I. it's not like we wasted coming back here. Um, we have 34 apples. All right, what, what else could horses want? Do they like carrots? Do horses like carrots? Or are they just apple fans? Um, do they like Mac OS X? Are they Apple fans? Or are they PC fans? Hmm. Horses. What what could you be? Okay, anyway, I'll bring them both along just in case. I don't think they like pork chop and steak, to be completely honest with you. Not sure if they're fans of that. Uh, anyway, so we need one more hexical essence. And then we'll have a full set. Our first full set of hexed armor. It's gonna be amazing! Woo! Okay. So, we have our sand. Uh, we have our clay. Let me just put all this stuff in the in the backpack here. Actually, we're gonna have to come back anyway, so I may as well put it in here. To be honest with you, let me just put it in here so we can free up some backpack space. And there we go. So all we need is the gravel. And all right, cool. So let's head back. And uh, horses, please don't have despawned. I need you. I need you. 